Greetings everyone and welcome to the dreamy town of Arcadia. I hope you're bundled up because it is a winter town and we are in August. So this comes from Tumblr user Pico Pond and we have on this island Jazz. We also have Agnes, Clay, Audie, Fuchsia, Chester, Lucky, Ketchup, Kid, Yuka, and Lolly. Now, the user has specified that the town is still very much a work in progress, and they're at a loss for what to do. So if you see anything interesting, leave in the comment section. And if you're seeing this through Tumblr, also make a comment in, uh, at uh, Pico Pond so you can let them know what you thought. And here we go. We're going to take a quick tour. Oh, so this is the grand entrance, and it looks like someone's not allowed here. Some rascal was starting trouble, it seems. All right. We've got a snowman, which I'm looking forward to building them in this game, actually. Uh, hopefully I can get a new Joy-Con before then. Oh, do we have the obligatory gifts for us? Many dream addresses in the uh, New Leaf games left. Look at, why is open not the first op oh, okay i guess they figure you're gonna drop it for somebody but still okay trade yeah oh okay interesting all right i think so far oh i've never seen a river this close to the beach before okay And is this supposed to make it seem like the sand was blotted out? Hmm. Well, these are all pro design. Okay. Oh, because the town's a work in progress. Let's climb up. Climb up. There we go. And we'll get around here. Ooh, little teddy bear picnic going down here. Oh, this is really nice. We have the lighthouse with uh, the waterfall that feeds in. Okay. I like this. Why can't I? I like that the ladder will let you climb on an angle, but not... Oh, look at the fruit trees and how they look. Like, the leaves look so iced. And they're so white, but, like, blue. Like, they're just so frozen looking. Look at the, look at the tree. The user has said that it, the snowflakes make it seem worse. Now, I don't know how old the post was that I found. But the Dream Suite's only, like, three weeks old at the time of the recording of this video. Okay, we got some heart shapes. So, it, the post can't be that, that old. Okay. Hmm. And they had also posted that they were going to have an apple orchard somewhere on their island. So I'm not quite sure of everything that they're planning, but... Hmm, you could play a game up on the hilltop there, I guess you can call it. Is that a mush... mushroom stool, maybe? All right, now we're going to keep going. Listen to the crunch of the snow beneath our feet. Got a little mermaid area going on there. Outdoor cafe. Got a reading and singing area. Doing their wash and their pond although it's not really a pond if there's a waterfall uh the, it, so i guess in their water source here but if you lose your clothes <laughs> they go down to the drink and just it does not look like it'd be a happy chase to find them oh but it's a closed off area so at least you'd know where it's going crunch 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 the snow crunches 
Okay, there's Agnes. Hi, Agnes. Then we'll keep going. There's Ketchup. Woo! Fossil excavation going down here. I actually like how smart this is. Hmm. I wonder if the if the anchor is a placeholder for something else, but I really like all like the idea of a statue being surrounded by water than the hedges. That is really classy. Let's see. I kind of feel too, and I know someone's house is here, and I know they have like the reading spot, but maybe have double, like make this symmetrical maybe, and have that there. But then you lose this spot, so I don't know. That's just what I think, because the user is looking for feedback, so I'm just giving my two cents. Oh look! They buried my hopes and dreams on this island too. Wow. It's always nice to see murals or homages to the things that I've lost. <laughs> Alright. Let us see. Do we miss the player character home? No. We only have Jazz, and we're kind of be coming up on it. Hmm. All right. Keep coming down this way. Mm -hmm. Go up here. To oh, okay. Here's Jazz's home. Got some outdoor cooking going down. All right, let's go inside. Okay. This feels very cozy. Uh, she's got the kotatsu where she can sit and be warm and drink her tea. And relax after all of her terraforming. So let's check out what I'm assuming is going to be the bathroom, but watch me be wrong, and it's the kitchen. Haha! -ha! It's always one or... It's usually a bathroom, but okay. And the ironwood uh, cupboard always be, is a staple in any kitchen, just about. And, oh, hmm. Hmm. Alright. Ow. Oh, I just stubbed my toe. Okay. Uh, we got the refrigerator. Got the bonsai. It's a very nice kitchen. I like how it's got, like, modern and, like, older style in there. Like, maybe the house was older, but it's been modernized. Uh, you know what? We're not going to do the back room this time. We're going to go in here. All right, an outdoor feeling, um, <laughs> reading or art room. I'm guessing it's a crafting room, judging from the uh, sewing kit or crafting kit on the floor there. Got koi. All right. Then, hmm, I'm going to do the upstairs. Oftentimes, basements are used as storage areas. Ooh. This is dreamy. house you know the player was looking for feedback and saying that they felt their island was very incomplete but i'm actually enjoying my visit you know i see a lot of towns a lot of islands like between tumblr discord and you know uh other streamers and youtube like uh, animal crossing new horizons is still very hot uh we're still within the first year and you know you see these amazing towns 
and you think more is the way to go, but less can be so much more. Granted, again, I don't know how old that post was. Maybe they've had a time to do the things that they want to see. Like, this is really nice. This is everything is so nice. But, Pico Pond, your town is very nice. And then there's some turnips there. Oh, it's up here. Let's see. Just a garden. Oh. It looks like a turnip garden. I get it. Oh, there's my obligatory yawn. <laughs> None of my content is complete without me yawning at some point. And this is where they're doing the flower hybriding. We got the uh, everybody's favorite outdoor cafe. Go up here to the shop, which has more outdoor seating. Hmm. I see ketchup. All right, we've been over here, so let's try crossing the bridge. Oh. All right. Okay. Yes, I do think we've seen everything. Hmm. I see what the player is talking about, how the town feels empty. But the town has good flow as terms of being able to get around. And, oh, what are those? Oh, because we're in the right months for the hibiscus. So therefore they're growing, even though it's very out of place. Let's see, did we miss anywhere? I don't think we did. No. Hmm. Let's try going this way really quickly. So I think there's a small animal home up here. Like up on a cliff? Yes. All right. I know we weren't up here. Oh, this is pretty cool. And I'm just making sure we didn't miss anything that the player may have made. Um. Okay, I think some of this area we were around. All right. Outdoor kitchen. For what you want to do that fresh cooking. Oh, there's my yawn. Okay. All right. I don't really have anything to recommend other than just do what you like. I mean, you kind of have a lot of artistic freedom when, with New Horizons, more so than we ever did with New Leaf. So, ooh. make sure to hit those links below to follow me on social media. Make sure to check out Pico Pond's Tumblr. Um... If you would like to see the development of my island, make sure to check me out on Twitch Tuesdays through Thursdays, uh, where I'll be working on my island and maybe doing some dream town tours during my stream if I have nothing else planned. Um, make sure to hit the links below to follow me on social media. Make sure to give this video a like, do subscribe, and if you would like for your town to be featured in an upcoming episode of this series, <laughs> saying it in one breath. Make sure to leave your dream address with a brief description in the comment section below on my most recent episode. And I'll randomly select one from there. And that'll be featured in an upcoming episode. So thank you again. And until next time, later taters.